Hey guys, Darren Cavanoki here for the follow-up interview with Ikaika. Sadly, as you've now picked up, we're not doing the usual Skype interview with Ikaika. I was able to reach him by phone. Sadly, he's not been returning my phone call since. To me, jail is like a vacation, bro. <laughs> you know, because all this out here, it's not nice. It's not pretty. So jail is a peaceful, happy place for me. I'm on vacation. I got a little bit of an update, but he's not here with me now. And candidly, that really bums me out. The latest news, as I understand it, is that Mill is in custody. She's in jail now based on some old warrants. Not exactly clear about what that is. And Ikaika is raising their two-month-old baby up in Oakland, California. How I wish it had turned out differently. The thing that I'm reminded of is that it's almost like somebody who plants a seed and then digs up the seed so they can see how it's doing before the thing actually flowers. Akaika went to treatment, but he left before it was time for him to leave. And Akaika is just like the guy who is now digging up the seed to see how it's doing. I hope and pray that things are actually better than what they look like, but I can't say with confidence what it is right now. All the signs, frankly, point to bad. And so I think the lesson for anybody who's watching this is, if you get struck by the good idea fairy, beware. You know, sometimes it's our own best thinking that can be our worst enemy. So if you feel like you're getting struck by the good idea fairy, please tell someone. Reach out, tell me. I wish I had better news to report about Ikaika. I, I hope and pray for him. And I, I am so thankful for everybody who's watching Breaking Point at Investigation Discovery so we can keep on changing lives one life at a time. Mm -hmm.